Microwave ovens aren't exactly on the cutting edge, but a local inventor has developed a new type of microwave that uses infrared technology. And his idea is going viral. CBS 2's Peter Doubt spoke with the inventor, who happens to share a special connection with it. When it comes to microwaves, it can be the most frustrating part. Is your food hot all the way through, or are you going to bite into a big cold spot? We rely primarily on our sense of sight, so it would be so much better if we could be like the predator and just glance over and see the temperature of our food to tell if it was done. Mark Rober from Valencia took to YouTube to demonstrate a new kind of microwave with thermal vision. Infrared cameras watch the food as it cooks, and the front of the microwave displays a heat map. So it will start as blue because it's cold, but then as it cooks, it will work its way through the temperature scale, eventually to red and then all white when it's done. And Rober says the heat map can also be sent to your smartphone. So you can put your soup in and then you can work upstairs. And if you don't see all white after four minutes, you can just add another 30 seconds of cook time from your phone. Rober is a former NASA engineer whose previous YouTube videos featuring his ideas have earned him national attention. It is cool to be able to just, you know, to live in this day and age where you can just reach an audience, you know, where I could put something out and I've basically been in a half a million people's homes in the last 24 hours. And one more thing, he's also my cousin. It is weird to like have you in my house. Normally this would be like Thanksgiving. We should be eating turkey right now, not doing an interview. Rober says he came up with his latest idea while microwaving a burrito in hopes of solving the annoyances of nuking food. It just makes sense that you could see your food cook and it just solves the age old problem of the frozen burrito. Rober has a patent on the design and is hoping to spread the word so potential investors will know there's a market. In Valencia, Peter Doubt, CBS 2 News.